At the World Women's Hockey Championship final today, it was another showdown. Canada versus the U.S. And even though the action is half a world away, young Canadian players took notice. As Lorenda Redekop tells us, girls in hockey today have increased opportunities to play the game at a higher level. 15 battles now, Hillary Knight with Decker. Knight waits, gets to Decker, she scores! Frustration today for Canadian fans of women's hockey. The United States takes command, 6-5. Once again, it was the U.S. winning the sport's biggest rivalry. After tying the game up at five, Canada lost 7-5. That doesn't deter 15-year-old Jordan Marchese. She hopes to be on Team Canada one day. Well, I definitely want to go to a post-secondary school, hopefully play NCAA in the States, Division I, and maybe get a little scholarship, hopefully. She's been marketing herself, emailing and calling coaches from U.S. colleges. There are tournaments, there's scouts watching you all the time, and it's great to just see all those people with the clipboards and writing down your name, hopefully. Oh, absolutely. And this league president says players are getting even more opportunities. The U.S. is launching a pro league next season with salaries of around $15,000 a year. Canada already has one, but it doesn't pay. In the past, to earn income to play hockey, you had to go to Europe. So there was quite a few European le leagues for ladies, but it looks like they might be able to stay home, which will be a good thing. Before they skated in the World Championships, many of the women on Team Canada played here at this tournament in Brampton, Ontario. It's been running for close to 50 years, and it now attracts 7,000 players from across North America. Players who say they're glad to have the chance to be competitive. When I first started, I started playing with guys because there wasn't really... A there wasn't a league for girls when they were four years old. Guys, they have all these opportunities and it's so cool that like women can now like go have scholarships and like play higher levels with it. It means young players have a clearer path to their hockey goals. One of them's getting to the Olympics and playing on Team Canada. And I want to play in CWHL for Toronto Flurries and I want to get a scholarship. But they're also still kids. I just want to have fun playing hockey. Lorenda Redekop, CBC News, Brampton, Ontario.